Good evening. I have a treat for all of you. And it's called Shitty Paleo Art. I don't know, this will probably just be a one-off. But, you know, I have a file, a, a folder that is, of about 80 images of shitty paleo art. Now, you may be wondering, Jeff, what is paleo art? Obvious, I mean, if you can't tell by the picture already, paleo art is uh, art that has to do with the fucking prehistory. Uh, dinosaurs and other various creatures that were once living but now are dead or maybe some of them are living uh like sharks are still around and of course the ancestors of these various uh creatures are still around the down the evolutionary tree but i i i came here today to talk to you about these shitty paleo art pictures i found because some of them are a real riot. And uh, I'm just going to hop right in here. This first one, uh, I think he's supposed to be a Tyrannosaurus. But he looks real shitty. He's got a very round head. And the, the weird stepping stones on the back. Like the, it's like spiky. It's real pixely looking. Almost looks like Godzilla. And his chest seems very broad. Very strange. This guy. <laughs> this guy's like, whoa, shit, I'm missing the sale at the grocery store. He's, uh, and there's that little tiny guy in the background just walking along, like, oh, man, I'm glad I went to the grocery store earlier. Hey. This man's giving you the double thumbs up. He's real pleased with himself. He's like, yeah, that's right. This is my branch. I own this. God, this is such a terrible showing of anatomy for dinosaurs. I don't know if there's actually any good paleo art in here for the art. Most of it. I mean, I, I saved it because it was shitty. But if there happens to be something good that slipped through, well, I'll let you know. <clears throat> I mean, not to say that these are terrible. like, Because this one's... Not the worst, but it's not good. It's not necessarily very accurate. Anyways, this one's like doing the whole draw me like one of your French girls thing, which is uh, great. This one, <laughs> it's supposed to be two separate images, but it kind of looks like the guy on top, the, the dinosaur, is like... In an anime, it's like one of those anime schoolgirls who are like running late to class. He's just missing like the backpack and the toast in his mouth. Oh, I'm going to be late for class. But it kind of looks like he's about to jump over like a tiny river to to say hello to the photographer man. He's like, dude, you're going to be late for class. You better hurry. I don't know why I'm giving them all the same stupid voice. This guy has never skipped a day of leg day in his life. Megalosaurus? It's supposed to be. I mean, his legs aren't particularly thick, but they are uh, very long, and he is spreading them. Spreading them harder than a... I don't know, something that spreads. Spreading them harder than butter on toast. There we go. <laughs> This one is given yield dick kick. This is one of the shittiest paleo, paleo art I've ever seen. There's nothing accurate about any of this. That's the duckest duck. My friend Unalive saw this one, and he said that is the duckest duckbill I've ever seen. And he's a paleontology major, so he would know what he's talking about. But uh, here's yield dick kick. And this one... I, I liked, I, I got this one just because uh, I thought it was kind of shitty, and I'm not really sure if this fella is supposed to be standing on, on, uh, all four, on fucking, standing on his hind legs like that.
but I'm no expert. This dude looks like he just, like, you know, in Harry Potter, when Dumbledore, I don't remember exactly what happened to him, because I had never really read the books, and I watched the movies, like, once, but he had, like, the, the thing where it's, like, uh, the one of the Horcruxes that, like, made his hand get all shriveled up and shitty looking. That's what happened to this guy. Ah, sorry, I had to sneeze. <clears throat> you have to forgive me and my transgression. God, my voice just decided it was just going to fuck off. <clears throat> Holy shit. All right, we're back. We're in business. But, uh, yeah, apparently that's Gorgonosaurus. Gorgon Gorgonosaurus. But, yeah, he's got real shitty, shrivelly arms. This fella... <laughs> he looks like... He's, I mean, he's supposed to be taking a chomp out of the, the guy on the right. But it kind of looks like he's about to take him ballroom dancing. And uh, I appreciate that. This is when you accidentally open your front-facing camera. <laughs> Especially the guy in the bottom right. It's hard to notice him at first, but <laughs> he also has a good expression. Uh... Nothing needs to be said about this one except for that it's a very obviously shitty uh, velociraptor. This is, I hate, <laughs> this is some sort of ancient crocodile that has like a gharial type body plan. But I fucking hate that they had to give it a human eye. Like, why is the eye so human looking? Fucking, that shit pisses me off. Also, if you look right above its snoot, you can see, like, two, uh, some sort of pleosaur or plesiosaur, some kind of fuckers hanging out in the distance on a date or about to smooch. And then this one is just, you know, a real majestic creature. I, I don't know if this is actually official paleo art or if this is just literally drawn by a child. Because I'm thinking it was drawn by a child. But, I mean, given the context of, like, the rest of the page where it has, like, stats and stuff, who knows? Maybe it was actually, actually drawn by a real human being who calls himself a paleo artist. But I sincerely doubt it. This is, like, what my drawing of a T-Rex would look like. I actually have a drawing of a T-Rex. I can't add it. I'll show you at the end what my drawing is. This one, I mean, it should be clearer immediately. <laughs> this boy never went to leg day. His legs are all knocky and knobby and shitty looking. The boy's leg bends like an S on the front. That's not how legs work, my dude. Not at all. Very bad. This one was already captioned for me. Shit, 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 shit. Uh, the guy in the front looks like he's... The guy in the middle of the, of the, of the group in the back looks like he's like, Hey, come here, I got some fucking cocaine for you. And the, the dude in front's like, That is tempting, but I must run. For I, I fear you will destroy me. <clears throat> That's why you guys watch me for the relatable captions, right? <laughs> Hashtag relatable. That feeling whenever you're approached by a drug dealer who's probably going to eat you. We've all been there. Sorry, I was closing my blinds, so if you heard a ruckus, that is what that was. Because it's uh, starting to get dark out. There's nothing left to be gained by having them stay open. This one is just wrong for so many reasons. Two little tiny Demetrodons, like, doubling up so they can fly? What the fuck is this? This is shit. This is the dumbest thing. I mean, it's made in 2005, so obviously it's a joke. But I, I hate it because it's cursed. Not so much that it's bad as it is cursed. Which makes it bad. 
Do not like it. Oh, here's a segment I like to call Dinosaur Lasers. For some reason, there's a large amount of paleo art edits giving the fucking subjects of the art laser eyes, and they're all great. Here's a good one. <laughs> Here's another one. Dude's just fucking lasering up into this fucker's mouth. This guy, this boy, this mammoth, he's taking out the the lads. Crack open a a, a warm one with the woolly boys. This one is uh, I have no words to describe it except Darth Maul, but green. This one's just highly cursed. For uh, it's it's real shitty. It not there's this is like a fucking fetal abomination of a Deinonychus. Dion sorry, Deinonychus, Deinonychus. I'm I'm not a fucking paleo major, so I don't know anything about pronunci pronunciating I don't know nothing about pronunciating these names I don't know anything about pronouncing these names but this is obviously very bad and I hate it and I wanted to get out of my sight immediately back to the lasers this one's one of the best he, this guy is going for the double kill on the on the footsie and the fucking inside roof of the mouth it's a very bold move Uh, a lot of lot going on here. Lots of lasers. There's a rave going on in the background, which explains the lasers pointing at the sky. That's not what they show you in the in the painting, but you know, it's one of those where you're supposed to infer the the context. Obviously, the the fellow who's getting his ass lasered, uh, he was at the rave, gave someone some fucking bad LSD, and now they're beating his ass. Rest in peace. This one is the best one. <laughs> Fucking missile triceratops horns. Just very good. Not the best, the most well done edit, but goddamn, I love it. This one's already captioned, uh, talk dumb, get the thumb. It's also delightfully shitty. Gotta love Iguanodon and whatever he's thumbing the shit out of. We got the most ripped Dunkleosteus I've ever seen in my entire life. This bitch is swole. Also, I mean, if I saw that in real life, I'd be fucked. Because I'd probably, I mean, if I saw it in real life, I'd be in the ocean. Which means I'd have to somehow escape by swimming, and that's not going to happen. I'd be dead. I don't know why I put this on here. It's not particularly shitty. It's maybe not exactly genuine to to, to the the creature, but I thought it's pretty good. Uh, and it, it, it was very swole. That's the main reason. This one is Yowie Hands. Uh... I think that's actually a fucking Indominus Rex from fucking Jurassic What's Your Majigger, maybe? I don't know for sure, though. If it is, then I just want the artist to know that they should eat my ass. If it isn't, then I don't know. And I don't know if that's supposed to be a tadpole on the bottom right, but it sure looks like it. Like a tadpole that's just on its way to frogdom. So... This one, I <laughs> the guy is up in the tree fucking screaming at the bitch below. Good. Here's a fucking snake, snaky ass head plesiosaur, plesiosaur, with lots of teeth that don't work like that. It's very bad. Anatomy do not work this way. Uh, then you got. This Tyrannosaurus, I presume, some sort of Tyrannosaurid, telling these young whippersnappers to get the fuck off of his lawn. 
You got <laughs> two two thick boys. And he looks real smug, and it kind of makes me a little upset how smug he is. Uh, this is just shitty. Not much to see here. These are more shitty drawings. Uh, once again, garbage. <laughs> so, at first glance, you may you may be thinking, yeah, that seems right. These were plesiosaurs were aquatic creatures. They were not meant to go on land. And there's no evidence to support that they did go on land. These plesiosaurs have will willingly beached themselves and are all sitting here thinking, ah, oh, fuck, how am I getting back into the ocean now? This guy works out at the library. This is a, a famous paleo art, by the way. Uh, famous not because it's good, but because it's shit. <laughs> Because the artist who drew it, I don't remember his name, my friend was telling me about him, but he he used to draw good paleo art, but then he decided to get real speculative with his art, and it got real shitty. I mean, as you can see. I fucking hate this one because it has sloth arms, and it has a dumb little tiny ass fucking garbage head. And he looks like he's trying to play the upright bass. And quite frankly, he offends me. This is just wrong in many ways. But he's he's very upset that he's late. Me on my way to fucking class after I sleep in for an extra hour. This is just shit. When you accidentally open your your self facing camera, this lad does not look great. I don't know what's happening here, and I don't really think I want to know. I like the color in this though; it has nice c use of color. It looks like some like classic seventies like sci fi fantasy art. It looks like it belongs on a Yes album. Uh, but it, it, it makes me slightly uncomfortable. This is me in gym class. Very scrawny, very upset. Very out of breath. Pleading with myself. For my existence to my short miserable existence to come to an abrupt end. This boy is trying to commit suicide by Ankylosaurus, and they they both look terrible. The fuck is that Ankylosaur Ank 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 Ankylosaurus look on his the look on his face very smug. I wish I could fucking. Speak English. <laughs> he knows he is safe under his curved armor. <laughs> Grunting in pain and anger. The creature is not good to eat. <laughs> this is me at the gym. Uh, posing. You gotta bay or nah. Fucking cut that out. It's shit. The only word I have to describe this one is thick. Damn! He thick, boy! Very... It, it, it exudes a strange sense of, of phallic imagery. Despite there not being much of a resemblance. Aside from uh, the the length factor, it's very penis esque. 
we're, we're leaving this one now. Oh, that's cute. They're dancing. It's me at prom. I don't know why I keep on making me me doing blank or me at blank references. Take a sip of my, my smoothie that I mixed up for myself. <laughs> this guy's just having a bad day. You can tell by the look in his face. Me, whenever my friend says I'm wrong about something when I'm clearly right. Fucking stop making these shitty garbage jokes. Fuck you. Fuck myself. <laughs> Not much to say here. Just me. This guy looks real shitty and weird. I don't like him. And here's two of them wrestling like a bunch of hooligans. I don't like that. This is just shitty. And he's like, oh, hey, how's it going? Uh, I'm just hanging out here with my human eyes, and now I'm turning into Kermit the Frog. What the fuck? And then, uh, this guy's just had a pretty fucked day. Not not doing too hot. The sud looks like he's about to catch some sick gnarly waves. Solid, dude. Time to go fucking catch a fucking wave, dude. I don't know what I'm doing. This boy is very horse-like. And it disturbs me. Coelophysis, you dumb fuck. You disgust me with your vague horse figure. That is not accurate. Me chasing pussy. Uh, very shitty stegosaurus on the beach. The boy, he have long leg. The boy, he stand. His eye is also very large, and his mouth is very tiny. Looking, and it, it there's something about this picture that really tickles my my pink. Tickles me pink, that is tickle tickles my pink. <laughs> me heading to back to the fridge at three a.m. to get more shredded cheese. <laughs> This boy is just weird looking. I don't like him. Me fucking sneaking through the living room at 2 in the morning. <laughs> when you accidentally open your yourself facing camera I'm gonna rehash a lot of these jokes just so you know because I don't have an original bone in my body when you see the last Doritos brand chip on the counter and you decide to mosey on over to it there's not much words for this except for it's real shitty once again Real garbage. I do not like the, the foot on the right. The three toes look very flaccid. Very cursed. He's very smooth looking. The more I look at this, the more disgusted I am. Me and the bay chilling in the hot tub. I don't think I've ever said bay in my life. <laughs> Mark that down. In the annals of history. In the annals of history. This is just a real shitty Spinosaurus. He's like standing very upright for some reason. And his sail is a little weird looking. In general he's weird looking. Uh, me screaming at 
the television whenever I'm losing a video game. You can tell I tried to make that one up off the top of my head and came out like fucking trash. That's why it probably looks like a possum, because it's trash. Get it? <laughs> All right. <laughs> Look at that smile. And he's a long boy. Look at that space between his front and back legs. And the little nubbin on his back. Everything about this is unsettling. If I saw this in real life, I'd shit myself 37 times consecutively. And then die of dehydration. This is me whenever my teacher tells me we have homework. Hashtag relatable. Am I right, fellas? Yeehaw. Me, the last thing an ant sees before I step on it. This boy getting kicked to the dick. Me arguing uh, with my neighbor over whose yard the tree is in. Real relatable right there, all of you property owners that watch my videos. All, all zero of you. Not to say that none of you are property owners, but there's no one who watches my videos, so even if you were a property owner, I don't believe you've seen this. Me, when I'm about to take a shit... Easy, easy joke. Actually, no. <laughs> Wait, I have a better one. <laughs> Me looking for the Lego I stepped on moments ago. This is just me on Halloween. Fucking shitty ass, skin tight dinosaur suit. He do have them some nice legs, though. That is not an Allosaurus. It looks so bad. God, that's garbage. <laughs> this one speaks for itself. Me waving at someone in public, and then the one on the to the right of him is me, slowly realizing that the person in public who waved at me wasn't actually waving at me, but instead the person behind me and that I just looked like an idiot the entire time. <sighs> Me, whenever I have chicken tenders. Mr. Steel Your Girl. I don't, I, fucking, I don't know. Me, once again, heading back to the fridge at 3 a.m. for more shredded cheese. That's that's the end of him. Oh, oops, wrong folder. Fuck. Uh, <clears throat> that was for later use. Funny joke. Anyways, oh wait, I said I'd show you guys the the fucking T Rex drawing I made once. First of all, you're welcome. In advance. I'll have to bear with me for a moment because I don't know where I am. Where is it? H-A-T-T-K-L-M. Here it is. Here it is. Truly a masterpiece of our time. Uh... I don't know when, why or how I got the idea for this. Uh, but I drew it, and it's very cursed, and I don't like it. Uh, my animals. <laughs> there we go, as promised. Shitty, cursed T-Rex. Paleo art. So, you know... I don't know if I'll ever do one of these again. And I wasn't really prepared. Maybe I should have actually like put some effort to write a script and have like little jokes prepared and stuff. But you know what? Fuck you. I'm not gonna. But I do hope you have a great day. If you watched this far into the video, uh, then obviously 
you you must like either suffering uh or maybe you think I'm cool, I don't know. The the only question that can be answered at this point is the fact that you're still here. Uh in which case, have a great day. Uh I love you. And if I came on too strong there, then get a restraining order. All right. Peace out. I'm leaving now.